Ooh, hot mama, look <laughs> at you. You look awesome. Thank you. I never know what to do with these cards. Take them with you. Done. Always take them with you. Your information's on them. I want to leave them, but no. then I think there's going to be one more thing I need to get out of the hotel room. Yes, but you need to take them with you anyway. Never, never leave those things. Are my glasses dirty or are they? No, they're scratched. Oh my gosh, I what scratched did you do? my glass. I don't know, I'm time for a new prescription. Mm -hmm. Well, it's time for a new prescription anyway, but I really like these glasses. I think we're gonna reuse the same frames. Hey, what's up family? I'm Rachel. <laughs> and I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos and we do product reviews and we talk about various keto topics and then every Monday, we sit down on our couch for keto on the couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week. So make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon. And that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. I'm just looking around at how awesome my wife is. <laughs> Because she has stripped the bed for the housekeeper. I don't want to touch other people's stuff. You I don't want to even touch awesome. our stuff. Awesome. So we are all packed up. I'm kind of sad. I don't want to go home. I feel like when like we go camping in the Keys, We've right? Had so you don't want to go home. We're definitely. We're already trying to figure out when to come back. I want to come back during the winter. Are you up for winter temperatures? in utah well here's what the skiing well i think that would be great but here's the here's the problem i was totally taken off guard by the beauty of this place i couldn't have packed or prepared for it and i'm afraid that we couldn't pack or prepare for the cold that this place can have right because i didn't even know why they had metal poles in the mountains now and there's, it's there's snow, snow measures yeah snow measurers yeah well yeah. when we were up on the top of the mountain Chris was telling me like this trees and stuff because I was telling I was trying to picture where are the ski slopes like because yeah. you have all these trees and he's like anywhere there's not a tree you can go skiing and I was trying to picture it covered in snow he's like picture the trees half the size and I'm like what and he was like those trees will sometimes be buried like a third to the half of the way of the tree like can you even imagine that no no because they are I mean they're giant trees so it's Sunday. We are all packed up. You can see, look at all our stuff over there. We totally snagged the luggage cart the night before. Yeah, it's because so terrible. they're so hard to find. Yeah. And uh, you want to show our little box there? Yes. We're going home with just a little bit of stuff. It needs We're going to bring own. Rachel's mom's stuff. And uh, yeah, look, look at this. We got this thing for Rachel's mom because she loves pecans. Look how we froze. We refroze the we re keto it, brick. But I didn't drink it yet. I'm <laughs> going to drink that thing. We got this Oh Hello pecan bar. Oh, hello. And uh, I'm excited about these. So these are oatmeal cookies. Like not, not just oatmeal, no. but the oatmeal cookies that have the cream in them. You know those ones, like the yes. little Debbie ones? I do. Awesome. No. Anthony loves them. Never Still had a struggle them. with those for me. He never had a struggle. So Ugh. yeah, we got, we got a little package going home, but here's the cool thing is they said we can freeze it. So we're not eating all of this. Ooh, there was a shake. We're not going to eat all of this in a day or a week. We're going to freeze it and maybe every couple days split one down the middle. The two things that we did have, what was your favorite? The strawberry. Um, strawberry it shortcake. Like, it was it a shortcake? Kind of, it's kind of like a parfait. It was so good. It was absolutely delicious. And that was not from Oh Hello. No, that was from the other company. That was from we'll Sugar High about. Keto. Yeah, we'll leave their information down below. They don't ship yet, but she said she's going to be shipping. But I do need to give a shout out because our subscribers brought to the meetup some delicious desserts and recipes that rival these guys. They really do. Right? I mean, there was a protein sparing coffee cake using keto chow. That was my first time tasting the protein sparing. It is very fast. spongy. It's it like is. an angel food cake yep. kind of sponge. Lynette makes, oh. oh my gosh, Lynette better be sharing that recipe so we can broccoli, do a video. It was like a broccoli salad. It was like a broccoli salad with broccoli and cubes of cheese Every and onion bite. and bacon bits. Oh my gosh. Delicious. All of the stuff there was delicious. 
I think I may have put like 10 pounds on just at our meetup. Easily. Right? It was so good. It's so, so delicious. So we're waiting for Chris to come pick us up. We're going to go to church with them. Yeah. Then we're going to go back and we're going to hang out with the kiddos because we have a late flight. Like our flight is 1130 at night. Yeah. But I like that because, you know, you go west coast to east coast, leave at 1130, sleep on the, or she'll sleep on the plane. I'll be working Hopefully. on keto on the couch. Uh, and then we land at six in the morning. So now we have our whole day. We'll probably, we're going to do keto on the couch live at 10 o'clock. Then probably take a nap. And then, I don't know, move on our day. So I like that. Do you guys like red eyes? I love red eyes because I feel like I don't lose a day. We were talking about it when we got here. That when I travel, I want to leave either in the morning or I want to leave at night because you have your day. Then you have your whole day. I don't want red eyes though. Can we do take the flight and not have a red eye? <laughs> I don't like those. So we're going to get one more sweep because every time we come, we always leave something and Rachel actually shook out the bed and my Apple pencil was underneath the sheet. 200 like, bucks. Oh my gosh. Like Apple pencil. I would have freaked. I would have gotten on the plane trying to pull comments using the Apple pencil and been like, where's my Apple pencil? So, take one more look. Always take that extra look. So we're going to make sure one more sweep. Wait on the phone call from Chris. I just heard my phone beep. That it may even be him. And then we'll talk to you guys later on. It's a sad day. We're going home. But they have front license plates. I didn't realize you guys have front license plates. Look at you all snazzed up. Yeah, you know so we just tried these. They are bacon ets, fried pork skins, queso flavor are they the best ingredients ever now touch of maltodextrin in the flavoring are they delicious yes will i eat them yes i will <laughs> because my favorite chip was cheddar cheese and sour cream ruffles that was my jam this is the seasoning of that that's what it tastes like so it's a pork rind but it tastes like cheddar cheese and sour cream ruffles okay wait Quick look at the ingredients. More important than the maltodextrin, which is in a lot of the flavorings, mm -hmm. what oil is it cooked in? It is, let me see. Does it say an oil on there? It says uh, fried pork skin, salt, whey, maltodextrin, whey protein concentrate, monosodium glutamate, cheddar cheese, natural flavors, citric acid, spices, yeast, like sunflower oil. Okay. Blue cheese, gum acacia, Onion powder. I was gonna. Yeah, I think it's part of the um, flavoring itself because it's all with the onion powder, buttermilk, paprika extract, sour cream, um, butter, lactic acid, garlic powder. Um, it does say corn syrup, solids, skim milk, and a natto extract. Okay, but that's all the flavoring. Yeah. What was important to me is I would rather have the little bit of maltodextrin in the flavoring and have it cooked in pork fat, which is obviously what that is, over having it cooked in canola oil, but not have mal all the, any maltodextrin. That's right. like, it's more important to me for the oil. And there's no reason for a pork rind to be cooked in anything than other than its own pork fat. Is this something I'm going to eat every single day? No. no. But is, is it going to eat on the plane? Yes. Is this coming to the movie theater with me? Yes, it is. Absolutely. Th this is delicious. Yeah. I can do it. Though. Rachel is attempting to shuffle Uno cards that I think are the size of a sheet of paper. They look like eight and a half by 11. They are huge. They are not easy to shuffle, but you definitely want to because otherwise... You're just Sam wins every time? Same, well, yeah. Well, that's what it is. I haven't shuffled enough. It's not that he's better at this than me. So if you're like me and you have a problem with nuts where you eat just way too many of them, Chris just gave me the solution. Try these ghost pepper almonds because you're not going to be able to eat more than two or three. I don't think you're going to be able to eat an entire serving without blowing your mouth off. So for all of our subscribers, who are Apple fans okay. and have heard Chris say, we don't do Apple. Yep. I just found out that Chris has some Apple products. We are going to work. slowly There's win him over work. to the dark side. The, uh, the front tills, the, the, the point of sale, those are iPads. Uh -huh. And our creative director has a MacBook Pro. We're, we're gonna slowly work you over to the dark side. Yeah. But I am curious, everybody letting us know down in the comment section, are you a Mac person or are you a PC person? Because you're usually one or the other and you're hardcore. Well, it's kind of like, uh, do you like your bacon crispy <laughs> or are you wrong? <laughs> you are doing something funny you have a little a bunch of people and mm -hmm. you're in you're at boy scout camp oh. and you're down there in front and you do a stupid little Skit. thing 
What kind of skit? It's funny. Acting skit. Comedy skit. Comedy. So, Comedy. you're... Oh. Oh. Chicken. Oh. Oh. Team two. This is like a boat. And it has this Seabell, thing. Sailboat? Sail. Sailboat. Sail away. Sailing? Sailing. Sailing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so this is what uh, Joe has said. I've got to have a tent. Because if, if, if we don't do that, then what we're we're not really even going in a tent. We're we're just like we're too glamping. Yep. Yeah. Glamping. <laughs> yeah. We've come a long so, way from that. So that is one of those counter. Bar stool? Counter and what's the bar. Not, kitchen counter. Not the, the not the bottom, but the top, top counter. Top bar. Top? Counter top. <laughs> All right, that's good. Top okay. Here's something uh, you get outside. It's like a piece of paper in an envelope, and it has a little mail on it. What mail, mail, postcard. Uh, really slow. Snail mail. Snail mail. <laughs> yeah. So we need to get this and bring it home because catchphrase is really, really fun. And there's been some things that have been like they've like Kate just did fish sticks, completely accurate. But you just don't get it. All I know is these are some smart kids. Really, I mean. Max precisely identified cooties. It was like a, a disease that people think like girls have and they don't. It's fake. It, it was awesome. Cooties. Yes. And rain <laughs> on children. Delicious. Oh my god, look at this thing. Those things are amazing. And yours They're is perfect. just the smooth head. <laughs> Peace, love, and low carb lasagna. Oh my gosh, yes, look at that. This is the best fudge I've ever had, keto or not keto. And we need to leave Utah so we stop eating it. We have to. I've never made it. The keto chow, the recipe for it is linked down below, but I've never made it before because, you know, I can't cook great. And this has to achieve a certain temperature. It has to be done right by someone who knows what they're doing. Holly knows what she's doing, okay? She needs a, you need a special license, a fudge making license, and she has it. And this is amazing. But I am, I, I just want to fill my backpack and, and all of my suitcases with, with this. I'm sad. You're sad? We gotta go home. I don't wanna go home because I don't wanna have to work. I know. <laughs> well, I don't wanna go home because I don't wanna miss the beers. It was so much fun. Bathroom, but she wants to come with you, okay? Okay, okay that just entered the video. <laughs> <laughs> so we made it. We're at the airport. We made it. We're at the airport. It is 10.30. By the time we get home, it will be six o'clock in the morning. At which point I have to get everything ready at home. As soon as we get home, Anthony's picking us up because he's awesome. I asked him to pick us up. I think we landed six seventeen. Then we're gonna go home, shower, maybe lay down for an hour or two. I don't know, maybe, possibly. I'm afraid to lay down. You know how that is when you're like, you lay down and you're like, will I get back up again though? Right, and uh, yeah, we're gonna do Keto on the Couch Live, which obviously, this video won't be out till like Thursday or Friday. I don't even know. We vlogged every day. We just didn't release every day. Right. <laughs> because you know what happened was we we didn't want to lose our time, right? I wanted to be able to enjoy the moment. And that meant, you know what, going today on Sunday, instead of rushing the vlog out and you guys not getting good quality stuff and us losing the opportunity to hang out with Chris and Miriam and Steve and Holly and all the kids. All we decided, things. you know what, we're gonna push that off. We're gonna let that come out tomorrow and we're gonna go from there. But what an awesome trip. What an honor and a privilege it yeah. has been to just be with friends mm -hmm. that have become family. Yeah, yeah, they really, really are family. And whether or not you buy keto chow or not, it, just because you don't buy keto chow, it doesn't mean that you can't go subscribe to their channel no. and join them on their live streams because they're there to support your journey, whether you use their product or not. No and and that's what I love about them. I mean, and that's what I love about Steve and Holly. And that's what I love about all of our subscribers and the folks at Redmond. Not everybody at Redmond does keto, but everybody at Redmond supports your journey wherever you are. And that's what I love about everybody. This was a great first meetup. I yep. feel really, really privileged to be a part of it. And yep. we are excited to get back home and keep going. So thank you very much for coming along with us yeah. on our trip to Utah, our first ever trip to Utah, our first keto meetup. And uh, we really appreciate all of you guys for subscribing, for supporting us. Now, if you like seeing videos like this, 
check out some of the other videos that we have linked right down there, which I got a point down there. Oh, okay. Also, make sure you take a look at the most recent video, which I'm going to put right over here. But whether you head this way or you head this way, don't forget to head this way, subscribe to our channel and click the little bell icon. And that way, every single time we go on a trip, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. bye.